They don't piss in pants. <laughs> this is one of those undescribable situations. I'll take him there. You live out in the woods. Mr. Django, he'd be, he be scared to live out in the big woods. <laughs> How about Mouse Bill? Tours are directing down in Florida. Tallahassee, I think. Is that right, Paul? Tallahassee? Yeah, yeah. They're so sweet. You think they'd take Mr. James? You think he's got the stuff? I mean, he is pretty smart. You'll have to pay. Well, you shit me? Cause you pay. <laughs> Two cents for the kids. For the kids. Yeah, <laughs> yeah for the he's kids. Like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You're gonna be as sick as mouse that dog. <laughs> oh, there you go. Oh no. <gasps> oh no. Come on, man. You did not have to do that. Oh. You killed my mom. Well, I knew I'd get him sooner or later. Just Dude. a matter of time, really. <laughs> you fucking cruel bastard! What an asshole. Yeah. <laughs> Give him to me. No way. You know, this film does a great job at having me forget that it's still supernatural in a yeah. way. I forgot that he, he could fix it. Wow. Oh, they're all gonna see it though. Please, John, help him. Look at the tail. No way! Holy shit! <laughs> what? Wow. So that always happens? Yeah. After he heals? Oh, wow. He was Dude. definitely definitely trying to save those two girls back there, and he just cut it for whatever reason. It was too much. Your circus mouse gonna live in a mouse city. Oh, boss person bad. He step on deal mouse to get back to. <laughs> Both of you, it is who the hell you think you are. Uh -huh. ah. 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 With the people you work with, person, not for long. Percy, I want your word. My word. His word means nothing. They make you like the characters yeah. and then, you know, they remind you that they're still in death row. Yeah, they show you the human side, the kindness and the tenderness. Don't forget about Mouthfeel. There's no such place. Why, Percy? Oh my god. It's the level of cruelty in this man. Are you kidding me? The anger I'm feeling inside right now. What a piece of shit. Come on, please realize. It's dry, please notice it. I want him to realize. Roll on two. Oh. Whoa. This is hard. This is the man that you let in here. No. He's feeling what he did. Yeah. Oh. So can you guys unplug him already? Oh my God. Is the, is John preventing him from dying? Yeah. Under control. Q2. Wow. That is a horrible death, man. That that was way more than monster, dude. From a person. Disgusting. See, the thing is, like, so many people that are in positions of control like this, they just do it because they want the control. I didn't know this bone just supposed oh, to be wet. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Coward. How can you say no? You saw yeah. what I did. Never quit dead. Now there's nothing can change that. And Percy is not wet. So he just gets away with it. Is that yeah. how it Sorry, Paul. I disagree with you on this one. Brutal's right. Let's put in transfer request to Briar Ridge tomorrow. Moving on to bigger and better things. Is that right, Percy? Yeah. Yeah, you better keep your word and better leave this keep place. Your word, piece of shit. Although, I don't know if that's going to be even better, because, like, we're just sending the problem to another place. Yeah, honestly. I mean, it doesn't fix the issue. Yeah. Poor old man. I can feel it from here. What do you mean? He out of the nado. 
He the lucky one. No matter how it happened, Dale the lucky one. Where else? And that's the jam. By the way, I did it though. Don't think he'd be back. Well, oh, his acting is amazing in this. Mm, yeah. Awful time now, boss. Dog time. Dog time. How could they not see that he's definitely innocent? I mean, come on. You need an official report. You need to conduct an investigation, yeah. of course. But yeah. come on, man. Like, you know it. You know, someone that's not showing any signs of being... Violent at all. I'm still coming down from my anger with Percy, man. That yeah, shit pissed me off so much. I know. The thing is, there are people out there like that. Yeah. that really enjoy to see other people suffer. Yeah. Without those people ever doing anything to them. Like, it's, it's so bizarre. Yeah. Like, if it's a personal vendetta, then I get it. Like, somebody right. screwed you over. Right. If they did something to your whatever. daughter or yeah. wife, husband, whatever. But in this situation, it's like, really? Like, yeah. you're already in the power position. Like, yeah. Oh, no. Sometimes she's, she's not herself anymore. She swears. She swears. Just pops out. Most awful language you can imagine. <laughs> she doesn't even know she's doing it. From the pain, yeah. Yeah, it's also gonna... Wherever the tumor is, it's gonna alter your personality. Oh, really? Because if it presses down on the right area of the brain. Honey, you don't tell me what's on your mind. I'm afraid I'll have to smother you with a pillow. <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking I don't know what I would do if you were gone. Yeah. I'm also thinking I'm gonna have the boys over tomorrow. This is one delicious treat, man, before I go to work. Well, I'm glad you're enjoying it. Hey, Brutal, you gonna hog all them taters? Yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> he put his hands on me, he took my bladder infection away. Why don't they do the same with the wife? You're talking about an authentic healing, a praise Jesus miracle. I am. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you're thinking about Melinda. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Sneak a sick woman into a sale, Bob? Oh, no, 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 no. Howard never stands for that. You know him. He wouldn't believe anything if it fell on him. So you're talking about taking John Coffey to her. How? How the hell are they going to do that? In the middle of the night. It's the only way. But let's not discuss this as if we're thinking of doing it. He's made up his mind. Yeah. I'm going to get some too, ain't I? My ass, you get some too. What makes you think you deserve any? Come on. Come on. <laughs> I've been good all day. I'll get to drink. I'm thirsty. Let's give me some. Yeah, he's gonna pass the hell out. <laughs> <laughs> They're so funny. They're like. Okay. All right. Okay. Behaving. Went, yeah, I know. Surprisingly. Uh, incident. <laughs> yeah. For now, we'll see. For now. But also, how are they gonna get rid of Percy? I guess the same way. His transfer needs to come through already, <laughs> like... <laughs> like, it worked. Anybody wants out, now's the time. We gonna do this? So, that'd be just fine. I'd like to take a ride. How does he know? How the hell does he know? I think it's very Stephen King universe. Like, The Shining. Yeah. Let go of me! Let go! What do you do? Nobody cares anymore, dude. He deserves it. You gonna put your arms up? Yeah, I don't feel bad for Percy at all. No, I'm not anymore. I feel bad, but I'm enjoying this. <laughs> we can. We are. So satisfying. I know. I'll give you a few hours of quiet time, Percy, so you can reflect on what you did to Dale. Yeah, if you're lonely, yeah. just think about Miss Leadpipe. <laughs> all right they're in the clear smart they got it all planned out i'll take y'all a few hours for you back oh no this guy was supposed to be out <laughs> interesting is he like an empath in a way he can I, feel i think so stop touching him and this guy got, gotta go back to sleep yeah man Man. Think he's the one responsible for that? those two girls? Oh, uh, dude, I don't know. I, I'm starting to feel like it because he's like out there. Yeah. Like crazy, crazy. And he's pure yeah. evil. So like it wouldn't surprise me if it was him. <sighs> he's literally like the gentlest I giant know. I've ever I seen. Know. Is that a word? The most gentle yeah. giant. Look at his smile. He just comes across so pure. Yeah. You know, so benevolent. Yeah. You know? 
Yeah, now how are they gonna explain it to them? Without yeah. them freaking out? Yeah. Just I trust like, us. I feel like this was <laughs> the easy part. They're just gonna be like, just trust us, okay? Yeah. So what's up? Yep. Oh Christ, Paul, what were we thinking? It's too late now. John. Yep, gotta go through with it. Who the hell goes there two thirty in the goddamn Ow. morning? It's it's us, it's it's Paul and Brutal. It's us. Jesus. John Coffee. Okay, relax. Ow. You stay right where you are. Relax. Relax. Oh, right there, I shoot. I said ho! Oh my god. Down. Ho! How? We are here to help. You're gonna have to trust me. Yeah, yeah, there's no time to explain right now. Just trust your friends. Although I could imagine it would be scary Dude, as hell. Like, I'm like, what is this guy doing here? Don't you go in there. Don't you do it. Oh my God, if he actually does it, he's gonna freak out. Yeah. How do you react to that, man? Like, if he can cure that. You know, obviously it's a good thing, right? But like, you're being prepared for that loss for so yeah. long and all of a sudden it's it's fixed. Just like that, imagine. And on top of that, it's someone who was on death row that performed that miracle. Words is so badly. Oh, hardly remember, ma'am. What's your name? John Coffey, ma'am. Like to drink. Oh, my heart is melting for John. I don't know. Kiss of life. Whoa. Is it done? Wow. Oh my God. She looks immediately much better. <coughs> but he's taking all this in, isn't he? We were going to the hospital in Vicksburg. It doesn't matter anymore. Did I have the x-ray? Oh, she didn't remember She doesn't at remember all. any of it. Yes. Yes. It was clear. There was no tumor. Wow. <laughs> yeah. I... Yeah. What a relief to such an extent that it's overwhelming. What a beautiful movie, man. It has so much heart. We found each other in the dark. I want you to have it, Mr. Coffey, and wear it. He'll keep you safe. Please, wear it for me. He's like an angel, man, on Earth. Yeah, he's a gentle giant. Thank you, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> I had to express uh, my hatred somehow. I hate guy. Percy so much. In a minute. Now. Right now. I want out now. Ooh. <laughs> that was a bit slap. Oh. He just went. <laughs> yeah, they're fed up. Now you deserve to be punished for what you did to Dale. Yeah. Yeah. But Percy, you mind me now. We'll also see you beaten within an inch of your life. <laughs> <laughs> we know people too. Hey. Yeah. Are you so foolish you don't realize that? Yeah. Let bygones be bygones. Hmm? Take that f***ing transfer. What happens on a mile stays on a mile. Exactly. Yeah, what he did to that guy, to Dell, was Del? unforgivable. Come on, man. He was about to go. And yeah. then you tell him about... First, he told him about First, the mouse. First, the Mouseville thing. And then... Made sure that he suffered, like, more than he had to. We'll talk. Yes. So no later. <gasps> oh! Oh no. He's gonna transfer it to him? No way! Holy shit. Oh! What? He did that on purpose? He was holding on. Hopefully, John feels better now. Yeah, he's out. What you looking at, you lamp noodle? Oh boy. Oh God. Yeah, he's gonna do something. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh no. Is that thing like e pure evil? Like, what is it? I don't know what that is. Because Melinda was also acting kind of funny, right? Yeah. We just assumed it was the... Uh, the tumor? Yeah. Or maybe this was just Percy's last, you know, act. 
Can't wait to read up on all the theories about this movie. I know. <laughs> it's so interesting. The lore and stuff. You already know I'm about to watch some uh, found flicks and heavy spoilers. <laughs> yeah. I punished them bad men. Yeah. I punished them both. Why? Why Wild Bill? I saw in his heart grab my arm. What he did? I saw what Wild Billy done. Yeah. Take my hand, boss. Oh, we're going to see it? it? It was him, wasn't it? But even if he can't see it, how can he prove it? Please. Oh, I got to do both. I got to give you a little bit of myself. <laughs> wow. Those poor girls, dude. <laughs> Feels so bad for the father, man. Can't imagine the kind of loss. Oh! Oh, he was painting. Oh. Those nasty people, man. Of course, he's he'd been inside the house already. Yeah. He knew where everything was. Yeah. You're making a noise. I'm gonna kill her. You understand? You understand? Those poor girls, man. How do you handle that, man? And he has to see it. Kill them with they love. They love each other. Now you see how it is. This poor guy. That's the way it is. All over. Wow. Damn. He did end up in the mental institute yeah. after all. Just not in high places. <laughs> That's exactly what he deserves. What a satisfying get. Ryan first. Rich too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. He ended up exactly where he wanted to be all this time. He should have just taken that fucking transfer. Careful what you wish for, man. Yeah. Yeah. Does hell know that coffee's innocent, I mean. <laughs> yeah. How can he help? What the hell are you, you going to do? Does he have the influence to do something about this? Stop the execution? No. They're going to execute an innocent man? If it can't help, don't tell him. I won't. That's so unfair. Like, that's... There's no way out of this for you, is there? I've been running through my head in a number of ways. I've done some things in my life that I am not proud of. This is the first time I've ever felt real danger of hell. Wow. And now there's no way to prove that it was the other guy because the other guy is also gone. Yeah. So... No confession? I guess you know we're coming down to it now. Another couple of days. Is there any way out of it? Anything special you want to eat for dinner that night? And rustle you up most anything. Meatloaf be nice. Mashed taters, gravy. Maybe some of the fine cornbread your missus make. <laughs> if she don't mind. You want me to take you out of here? Just let you run away? How would you do such a foolish thing? Because you're innocent, man. You're innocent. On the day of my judgment, when I stand before God, and he asks me why did I... Did I kill one of his true miracles? Yeah. What am I going to say? It was a kindness you done. I want it to be over and done with. <sighs> I'm tired of never having me a buddy to be with. Mostly I'm tired of people being ugly to each other. I'm tired of all the pain I feel in here in the world every day. So he is like an empath, huh? Mm. It must be something that you want. Never see me a flicker show. <laughs> oh. <sighs> wow. Yeah. It reminds him of John. Yeah. <sighs> what a powerful scene. What is angels? Angels just like a him. <laughs> At least one last thing, right? Yeah. I'm not ready for this, man. No, I'm fucking not ready. Uh, I'm trying to hold on. <laughs> be all right, fellas. This is the hard part. I'll be all right in a little while. Oh. I'll give it back after. 
Man, I wish they could try to do something. You know, it had me a dream. I dreamed about Dale's mouse. <laughs> I dreamed Mr. Jingles got down to that place Boss Howard talked about. That Mouseville place. <laughs> I dreamed they as kids. How they laughed at his tricks, my. <laughs> Those two little blonde-headed girls is there. We all watch Mr. Jacobs roll that spoon. <laughs> that sounds nice. <laughs> yeah. It sounds actually quite nice. It's so unfair, man. It's like the kindest human being ever. Yeah. There's lots of folks here hate me. I can feel it. It's like bees stinging me. I feel how we feel that. Yeah. We don't hate you. Can you feel that? Kill him twice, you boys. Oh, if only you do. Why don't you make them see? It's so hard for them, man. Yeah, yeah it's... Wipe your face before you stand up, Dean. <laughs> yeah. Roll on one. I can't believe they're gonna do it. Yeah. Do you have anything to say before sentence is carried out? I'm sorry for what I am. <sighs> Please, Bo, don't put that thing up on my face. Don't put me in the dark. I was afraid of the dark. <sighs> Fuck, dude. All right, Joe. Ah, oh, that's so unfair. That is so unfair. This is such a hard watch. Dude, like at every turn, it's hard. But this one is just... Have mercy on your soul. Yeah. Yeah, I feel you, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you have to say. Yeah, it's so hard. He can't, he can't give the order. Wow. Of course, he's the regular voltage won't probably even do it for him. <laughs> yeah. I'm so happy they didn't show no. that much because no. that would have destroyed me completely. No. <sighs> yeah, just giving it back. Wow. It's it's so unfair. <laughs> he helped as much people as he could while yeah. he was here, at least. I just couldn't do it anymore after that. It was brutal either. We both transferred out, took jobs with boys correctional. Yeah, there you go. Catch him young became my motto. Yeah. <laughs> Makes sense. One thing I don't understand. You said you and Jan had a grown son in 1935. Is it right? The math doesn't work, does it? Do you feel up to taking a walk? Both of them with their little raincoats? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, what? Wake up, old fella. <laughs> oh, he's oh. <laughs> He kept a little mouse. Isn't JB? Come on over here and see this lady. Can't be. There's no Jingle. way that's Mr. Jingles. Wow. You're kidding me. <laughs> no way. No way. Bienvenue au Cirque de Mousy. Oh. Go on. You can do it. He's a little old fellow now. This mm. isn't exactly the Mouseville we had in mind, is it? <laughs> they built Mouseville? That's why the toast. Cold and dry. I think Mr. Jingles happened by accident. And I think... Part of whatever magic was inside of him just slipped into my tiny friend here. <laughs> <laughs> wow. John had to give me a part of himself, a gift the way he saw it, so that I could see for myself what Wild Bill had done. Yeah. Oh, yeah. When John did that, 
part of the power that worked through him spilled into me. Oh. He infected you with life? It's a good word as any. <laughs> <laughs> he infected us both, didn't he, Mr. Jangle? Totally lasted. They had a long life. Yeah. I'm 108 years old. Wow. I was 44 the year that John Coffey walked the Green Mile. Wow. He mustn't blame John. He's just a force of nature. <laughs> oh, I've lived to see some amazing things, Ellie. Yeah. But I've, I've had to see my friends and loved ones die off through the years. Yeah, yeah. of course. Brutus Howe, oh. my wife, my boy, <laughs> and you, Elaine. <sighs> You will die too. And my curse is knowing that I'll be there to see it. Yeah. It's my atonement, you see, for letting John Coffey ride the light. <laughs> I mean, there's nothing he could have done, though. Yeah. Like, I have no illusions of immortality, <laughs> but I will have wished for death long before death finds me. <laughs> wow. Mr. Jenkins? Wow, it's insane that they lasted that long. Like 108 years after this day. Or the day that. Yeah. You know? Where you been? Hmm? Been worried about you, little boy. You hungry? I think about all the people I've loved mm -hmm. now long gone. And I think about all of us walking our own green <laughs> mile. Wow. Each in our own time. Yeah. What a line. <laughs> but one thought. More than any other, keeps me awake most nights. If he could make a mouse live so long, how much longer do I have? <laughs> yeah. We each owe a death, but oh God, sometimes the green mile seems so long. <sighs> wow. No words. <laughs> Incredible. What an incredible film. Wow. <sighs> what a ride. What a journey. Just wrecked. <laughs> and that was three hours? It didn't even feel like it, three hours. It was Holy pace. shit, the pacing of this film is... So well, dude. Guys. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. I don't know what to say. Oh, such Thomas an emotional... Newman. There you go. Somebody commented on Shawshank that it, it reminded them of... Uh, like his style of music, uh, yeah. of Fighting Nemo in, in Shawshank. And it, it makes sense. It, I yeah. can also hear that here. Yeah. Oh, sorry, I'm an emotional wreck right now. <laughs> what great movies have <clears throat> we been watching lately, I know. man? Shawshank was great. <laughs> this was really good. It was yeah. not, I don't know. It caught me by surprise. <laughs> After that first hour, there's no real indication that this is going to be a supernatural right. story in any sort of way. Yeah. So I wasn't expecting that twist. That was a huge twist for me. I was like, oh, I, I guess we have to shift gears now into something a bit yeah. more open-minded in a way. You know, and then the, the crazy shit starts happening. I'm <laughs> like, wow, this guy is really something special. But yeah, ever since... Uh, Ever since they introduce him, it's like, it's really weird. You just have this feeling like, no, this guy can't be it. There's no yeah. way. There's no way he did it. Like, you just see yeah. his demeanor and it's like, uh, similar to Shawshank. When you see, uh, you know, the lead there, you're like, this guy? Yeah. Really? Something must yeah. have happened there. Something does not add up. And yeah. of course, it, it is the same case here. What great acting, the acting throughout this entire film. Amazing wow. on everyone's end. It was really heartbreaking but like for me the one silver lining is that at least he doesn't have to suffer anymore yeah because i think like he's like similar to like what we would call an empath i guess right yeah yeah he, he can feel everything. other people's emotions and yeah like w almost what kind of people they were as well yeah you know i thought that was interesting right like what's in people's hearts so it's like yeah. i i can't imagine how hard that must be day yeah. in day out like he said it's in the world right they they yeah what does he say he killed them with what they they love right he yeah killed he with, killed them with their love yeah their love for each other that's and what that's, he said. that was the hardest it's, part and um what a wh horrible man yeah him and percy were like but see oh. like they're the exact antithesis of what Paul was of what brutal was of yeah they're the opposite there you it know? was like the good and the the raw evil 
right? Yeah. And the way that people abuse power and then yeah. just pure goodness. Yeah. And the people that are actually trying to make a difference, you know? Yeah. It was a great, it, it's a great story, man. Yeah. Like, I'm, I'm low-key, like, stunned into silence because, uh, like, obviously, that's something that I really loved uh, about this writing. Like, I get, get just emotional yeah, from I know. such a film, dude. I'm oh, an emotional writer. God. <laughs> Love Tom Hanks in this. Love the, yeah. the, the the music. And yeah, Michael Clark Duncan was yeah. a stellar performance, a yeah. highlight. I yeah. He did a really, really, really good job he, at being this just benevolent force yeah, of just, nature. Just pure yeah. goodness. Like, yeah. as an actor, I'm like, how do you even so, do that? Like, you just... It, it radiates. Yeah. <laughs> you know, that's the best way of yeah. saying that. It just comes... You know, he yeah. is the embodiment of, of... Innocence. Yeah. And it's like, you know, like with certain moments, like how his gaze almost makes him look like a little boy. Yeah. Yeah. Where, I, I noticed that too. And it's... May he rest in peace, man. What a great actor. That performance just... it blew me absolutely away yeah everyone's performance every single really, yeah everybody and, here was you know, we top gotta, notch we hate a person for yeah, a reason no, we right hated, we hated <laughs> uh we hated wild billy sam rockwell who's also a really talented actor yeah um and like well that's your job right sometimes you gotta play really yeah. really you gotta terrible play the baddie. people Mr. But Jingles, we love Mr. The Jingles. Best, I was about to joke about <laughs> oh, that. Uh, the <laughs> best performance, the best performance was most definitely Mr. Jingles. I Mr. think Jingles. Mr. Jingles deserved an Oscar nomination yes. for this performance. Because <laughs> it was, you know, it was 108 years in the making for this performance, I know. Mr. Jingles, you know. Yeah, Mr. He got Jingles the cast and call back. He was like, hey, we yeah. need to reshoot, you know. He kept coming back, years. you know, <laughs> traveling back and forth in time and all. Oh, it's man. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching with us. This was a this was a long journey and it was a great one. Yeah. I really appreciate you guys for recommending this amazing yeah. piece of filmmaking because it was amazing in it every really regard, was. performance, music, cinematography, and, uh, you know, core message. Everything, yeah. The message behind the film is so beautiful. So thank you. And we hope you enjoy, guys. And we'll see you in the next one. Take care. See ya.